Hello everyone, welcome back. So as you're watching this video, I can't quite believe I'm saying this, but I am a married woman. If you're watching this video, it means the wedding has happened and I didn't do a runaway bride, which I'm joking, I'm not going to do that. I thought I would share with you some of the stuff that we've got to decorate our wedding because I found it a really enjoyable process getting it all um, deciding how we want it to look and everything but it's been quite difficult so I thought if I shared it with you then it could help some of you that maybe are planning upcoming weddings I don't know I don't know like if you're going to be interested in this but I thought I would just do it anyway so right in front of me I've got these um frames and obviously a lot of this stuff that I'm going to show in this video is great for your home anyway regardless of if you're planning a wedding or not if you have this kind of style um, and you have this kind of look so these are really pretty frames from the range they were a couple of pounds each there's hearts squares and also circles and we have six of them and we're using them to put pictures of our grandparents in that are sadly no longer with us going to put these on the card table so that in some way they're there with us at our wedding and we thought that was a really nice little touch so that's the idea for this and obviously if anything does change which it probably will then you will see in our wedding video a lot of people have asked me if we're doing we're vlogging the wedding or anything like that we're not actually vlogging it per se ourselves um, but we are going to be having a wedding video made and we're going to be putting a special version of that on our channel um, when it's ready. So that could take a few weeks to be ready, but we are going to be doing that. So watch out for that video. This is a little bike, um, and you can see it's got bubble wrap in it, but it has three baskets. It's basically a plant, so you can have it in the garden, but for a wedding, you can just put it on a side or a table with little flowers in, and I just thought it was a really cute little thing. We're actually really lucky to have a wholesaler's, um, like a gift wholesalers near where we live so I got that from there I'm not sure exactly where it's going to be available from but I would assume a lot of gift websites sell it like this company will wholesale it out to them so obviously search like mini cream bicycle planter or something like that um, but that's that and I just thought that would be a really cute little touch so we also have these which Ricky got from um, Hobbycraft and probably couldn't see there but you may be able to see I don't know if I'm holding these up the right way B A I don't know if it's backwards or forwards in this camera it might be backwards but basically it says bar um, so we're going to have this above our bar they're letters that light up they're actually made of cardboard um, I think they're around £8 each and we couldn't really find any others I know I got ones from Primark but we could only find the A in the end so we got these ones um, and then you just put them all together yourselves and they light up so we thought we'd give those a go this I'm really excited about, I have no idea where it's going to go but I thought it was so cute so this is a metal love pl plaque or sign um, it's kind of like that antique gold um, and it's just twirly love with an arrow and I just thought that was so cute I think we're definitely going to have this in our room after the wedding but a lot of the other stuff I'm planning on selling because I think it would just be such a waste to have it sitting in our shed or loft like, and no one using it again. I'd rather them go to good homes and be used again and people enjoy them. So, but I really like this and this was from the range if you want to buy it. So the next thing is rather cool and I think, I don't really think we have anywhere in our home for it, but I think it's perfect for a wedding. So it's um, a, fo a frame with like this hessian soft centered bit. And it says time to drink champagne and dance on the table and it also comes with some little pins which I guess it's a pin board I suppose that's what it's meant to be used for and um, we're just going to use it as a decoration um, very shabby chic and if I didn't already tell it's from the range um, I'm not sure of all the prices we've kind of bought these everything over time but I thought that was so cute anyway next I thought I would show you our huge box of bunting so um, this is a mini version of it which we actually got for free because we bought so much but I will just quickly show you so the bunting theme for the wedding is I don't know how many pieces I picked up um, right so we've got the floral which is pink and pale a little bit of pale blue and like a white cream background a plain cream and then a hessian and then it just repeats so I really like that I didn't want anything too 
ditzy print too um, bright or like with loads of different colours so I thought this would be perfect we ended up getting about over a hundred meters of it which is crazy um, it was all from eBay and probably the best price that I could find for bunting like whether you want to rent it or buy it like that again was a whole big process to even find bunting um, and I do actually have it as well I don't know if I'm showing this very well because I don't want to wreck it all but the plain one where it was plain cream before is plain pale pink it's just for a bit of a mixture um, and there is a lot of it so I'm just trying to keep it all together in this basket for now but I'm really excited to see what that's going to look like these are our um, table number frames so we um denied about what to do about this and we've gone through loads of different ideas but in the end we decided to keep it simple and just do table numbers so we found these frames at Matalan I think they were four pounds each um, and I have just put in the actual frame some um, like scrapbook paper you can buy it at Hobbycraft or the range and then that one's a pink floral and then I did um, a music note one because you just get loads of different ones so I thought it would be nice to do a mixture and then we don't have them yet so I can't unfortunately show you but um, in the centre we're going to have a wooden number so say for example it was a one or a two um, and that's going to be sprayed gold um, and that will match all of our um, name places, name settings, uh, we're having wooden names sprayed gold so they're kind of like joined up writing sprayed gold you'll see in the end in the video but you know they're they're very pinteresty i have to say oh we have this which is chalkboard with a little tray i found this in tk maxx after looking for ages um this basically is going to go on the bar with our bar menu on um so everyone knows which drinks they can order so that's really cute and i think it was about 16 pounds 99 um, but basically I just wanted a, a white decorative chalkboard so I found this one in the end and I was quite pleased with that really you could put maybe something in the little tray like some flowers or just leave it plain um, I also got this from the range I don't know if we'll end up using it but it was quite inexpensive and it just says wedding day and it could be nice to have on a door or just hanging from a tree or just you know to just brighten up a corner um, you may or may not know by now depending on what's gone up on Instagram or anything that we had a barn wedding so the reason we got quite a lot of stuff is because the barn is just an empty shell and we had to do everything to it nothing is already in there so it's quite a challenge but one I've quite enjoyed taking on so I thought we'd pick that up because I, this seems like so much stuff but I know when we get to that barn to decorate it it's just gonna feel like nothing at all this mirror I know some of you eagle-eyed people saw in one of our vlogs um, this is not a mirror I don't know why I said that it's a frame it was from home base and it has nine frames within it this is what we're going to be using for our table plan we originally had eight tables and the center was going to say like please find your seat but we now have nine tables so it's perfect um, and we are actually mounting this on a much larger which I didn't bring in because it's just so heavy but a big shabby chic mirror because our easel we've got a big wooden easel that the caterers are providing for the table plan to go on so this would just get a bit lost and it's fairly small really so it's going to be stuck onto a larger mirror and then this will be in the centre of it so hopefully that will look quite cute it's something I've still got to do because we're still finalising all of the table plans but hopefully it will work out and my idea will come to life so just a few more decorative bits I picked up all of this stuff from the same wholesale warehouse um, again I'll try and find out where you can get it from I got these little baskets they're actually napkin baskets so you usually would put napkins in and then just put that on the top to weigh them down we're going to use these to put orders of service in for the church or maybe to hold confetti cones or something like that so we've got three of those just in case we may just need one um oh my god i'm like piling up with stuff here um i got this i got two of these little glass jars in these wooden little mini crates with handles and they say petty flowers so little flowers um which little flowers can go in be dotted around found these little bottles which are wrapped in twine they have little hearts on that match the hearts in the baskets 
um, again little wildflowers or little roses or something could just go in them very simply but decorate some more blank corners. I did get this as well which probably was a bit pointless but I think it's a little like spiced rack or it's something for the kitchen really to just hold you could even put tea, coffee and sugar in it but they're quite small um, and then they're in this little rattan tray with hearts on and again they could just go somewhere you know just to decorate it all a bit more I just kind of panicked a bit and thought oh, I need to buy everything so um, also found these hearts there you can kind of get these everywhere to be honest they're quite inexpensive they do hang up with this twine but I've managed to find two little ones and three large ones they did actually have little hearts hanging in the middle of them with garden quotes like I love my garden type of things but that wasn't really relevant so I just cut them out and I just think they look much more pretty and simple now so I got those the last thing in that box is that paper that I lined that I put in the frames so you can see you get loads um, and these are really good for loads of things and um, we're also making the confetti cones out of similar paper yeah in this video you're, you're now my husband I've enlisted the help of my husband to pass me things because I cannot move. <laughs> so husband, can you please pass me that? Here is that. Thank you husband. So, oh, okay, you can't really see it on the camera. So this is our post box which we all did and it was all flat packed. And my dad um, kindly put it all together for us and painted it. I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but it does say post office and ER, like Elizabeth Royal. And you can put something in this front section. Um, it's just a wooden one. Um, I got it off Etsy and it was quite cheap compared to a lot of the ones that you can hire or buy that are like £100. Um, and I just thought it was really cute. And it has a little heart on the top with a lid so you can take it off. And all your cards can go in here. Your wedding cards. So that's very nice show it on these these cushions so we have <laughs> we have a seating area that we kind of needed to fill up a little bit and decorate so my mum found these in Dunelm is it called it's just Dunelm now isn't mm -hmm. it not Dunelm Mill so we've got heart is this in order mister and see where we're going They were four or five pounds each and I think you could, I don't know if you can get initials as well but just for the wedding they seemed perfect they're sort of quite a rough hessiany feel with the, with the black like lettering and picture like hearts and things so hopefully this will make one of the seating corners a little bit more comfortable for everyone and it will look quite cute as well okay I realize this is getting super duper long so I've just got one more little box of things to show you so the first is a pack of everything's fallen out of it pack of photo booth props it comes with a large frame and loads and loads of like lips hats moustaches that you put on sticks so hopefully our guests can have fun with all of those like dressing up and not dressing up but you know do little photos with those we have some hessian um signs i will just show you one of them it says thank you and i got this really cute idea again from pinterest that um we could take these off with us when we go and do our photos like our photos on our own with the photographer and ha hold it up together with the banner saying thank you and then we can make those into our thank you cards a little bit later on down the road when we've got all of our photos back so i just thought that was like a nice little addition this one is exactly the same and it says cards on it so it can go above the card table we also have another one that says mr and mrs so i may have gone slightly overboard on the burlap signs they could be everywhere but i thought that would be nice um along the top table so they don't all have to go up but i think the more the merrier we have this um sign which says just married which is pink and gold um it looks like this and it's by the brand ginger ray which quite a lot of stuff is from actually we got this which is going to be going in a frame by our polaroid station and it says shake it like a polaroid picture grab some friends snap a picture stick it in the guest book leave us some love katie and ricky and the date oh you can see the date because it's already happened 
<laughs> I've been so thinking about no one knowing the date and it's on there, but that's fine. So that's gonna go in a frame. Loads of packs of Instax film for our Polaroid cameras. So we have like 80 or something and we got them in, bought them in bulk. So these are, this is one of the Instax cameras. This is actually my mum's that I gave to her for Mother's Day. And I have a red one, so we're just gonna use them. We didn't buy them. So there's two available for people to take Polaroids in and then put them in our guest book, which is this one. I won't get it out, but it's a wooden guest book with obviously paper inside. Um, people can stick their pictures. We're gonna put double-sided tape in this book so you can just literally peel it off and stick it on and um, write a little message as well. And that's by Ginger Ray. Um, a few more things, I've got some paper floral crowns again for the photo booth because I just thought that would look so cute. I've got this little one that says confetti here, champagne there, love everywhere. It's a wooden sign and it's by Ginger Ray. And finally, I'm just gonna show you our confetti. We got biodegradable, real petal, like freeze, like dried petals, um, and these are delphinium petals, and there's like purple, white, cream, pink, and stuff. And there's three packs of those, and they're all gonna go in these confetti cones that I spoke about that have yet to be stuck together, but they will be, and they'll look really cute. So. That is just about everything. I wish you could see this room right now, it's ridiculous. Um, I'm gonna go straight into filming my gift one, otherwise I'm not gonna get it done. And then I'm gonna clear this huge mess away. So yeah, make sure you watch out for the gift one and I hope you enjoyed it. If you're getting married soon, good luck. I hope you're enjoying all of your planning and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. No, it's the love sign, you donut.